A Deputy's Unexpected Discovery When a deputy brought his squad car to a mechanic for what appeared to be a routine headlight repair, he anticipated a straightforward solution. However, the mechanic stumbled upon an issue that was anything but simple, and to make matters more complex, it was a problem that couldn't be fixed with tools. To say the deputy was astonished would be an understatement, especially when the true nature of the problem came to light. This incident unfolded in Illinois within the McHenry County Sheriff's Office, MCSO, an organization comprising approximately 400 dedicated individuals who considered their officers as conservators of the peace. Recently, one of their deputies found himself in the spotlight all because of a malfunctioning headlight. Upon returning to work after a brief absence, the deputy noticed a malfunctioning headlight on his squad car. Although not a major issue, it required prompt resolution before he could resume patrol duties. Determined not to let his team down, the deputy wasted no time in taking the vehicle to a local mechanic. However, what the mechanic discovered inside the car was rather peculiar. The revelation was so astonishing that it would likely leave you as incredulous as it did the deputy. Deputy Sandra Rogers, another officer present at the scene, revealed that while replacing the headlight, the mechanic noticed that some of the wiring had been chewed through. What could possibly have been responsible for this wire-nibbling mischief? The prime suspect was a rodent. The mechanic explained that rats often find their way into vehicles and gnaw on the internal wiring. Regardless of the rodent culprit, the damage needed immediate attention. But as the mechanic continued his work, he stumbled upon yet another unusual discovery. According to Deputy Rogers, the mechanic found a collection of leaves inside the car that appeared to form a nest. Upon closer inspection, he uncovered the occupants of this nest. Brace yourself for what comes next. Evidently, a mother squirrel had managed to squeeze her way into the car's wheel arch and establish a cozy nest. While the mother squirrel was absent at the moment, four baby squirrels were nestled inside, slumbering peacefully. The fact that they were still alive was nothing short of astonishing, according to the mechanic. The mechanic promptly contacted the deputy, keeping him informed about the situation. Not wanting to miss out on an educational opportunity, the deputy gathered his children and headed to the garage. After all, who could resist the allure of four adorable baby squirrels? Taking care not to disturb the sleeping infants, the mechanic skillfully removed the car wheel and gently transported the nest inside. Remarkably, the baby squirrels remained undisturbed throughout the process, swiftly endearing themselves to the onlookers' hearts. When the deputy arrived, he realized he couldn't simply abandon these baby squirrels to their own devices. He made the compassionate decision to take them home. Could this officer's kindness have known any bounds? The babies, with their eyes tightly shut, huddled together in a circle throughout the journey. The deputy's intention was to reunite the babies with their mother. He hoped she would return to the same location where his squad car had been parked. Thus, he placed the nest there and patiently waited. Fortunately, his plan unfolded seamlessly, and the mother squirrel soon made her appearance. The mother squirrel swiftly gathered her babies and scurried off in search of a new abode, but one might wonder why she chose the wheel arch as the nesting spot. According to experts, squirrels are naturally drawn to warmth, making the wheel arch an ideal location to keep her offspring cozy. Explaining this behavior, one source clarifies, they're drawn to the warmth emanating from the engine, which provides them with a snug place to nest. Squirrels tend to make quite a mess when they bring in nuts, acorns, and nesting materials. Interestingly, rural areas often contend with rodents, such as squirrels, taking up residence in vehicles. Cards, it seems, offer the perfect nesting environment. Hence, it's advisable to park in cooler areas to make the vehicle less enticing to creatures seeking warmth. Another concern is wire chewing. Squirrels and rats share a proclivity for gnawing on wiring, making it a good practice to apply a flavor deterrent like apple spray to the wires. Such deterrents are typically available at most veterinary clinics or pet stores. Some sources suggest that squirrels have an aversion to the scents of peppermint and curry. However, it's vital to exercise caution as peppermint can be harmful to small pets. Therefore, it's essential to keep these sprays away from them. Another strategy to discourage potential squirrel damage is the use of predator scents. Sprinkling used cat litter in the car can unsettle the squirrels and deter them from nesting. 
Nevertheless, it's crucial to consult with a mechanic before resorting to any spraying or sprinkling inside your vehicle. There's a risk of causing further harm to the car while attempting to ward off animals. While many may not consider a squirrel's life worth saving, the actions of the deputy and mechanic are truly heartwarming, ensuring the safety of the baby squirrels. Now these young ones can flourish in tranquility. Nevertheless, it serves as a reminder for all of us to periodically inspect beneath our vehicle hoods and inside our wheels.